Legends, welcome back to another episode where I test every single vehicle that I can find in Forza Horizon 4. The vehicle I'm testing today is the 1985 Ford RS200 Evolution. Legendary, for sure. Alrighty, so, it's a Class S1. Man, it's a change of pace. 839 performance rating, all-wheel drive, and it's mid-engined. Wow. Let's see how it stacks up against the rest of the vehicles. So, it looks a bit like a frog. <laughs> yeah, it's a completely style change, you know, compared to the other vehicles. Okay, let's see. Screaming four cylinder. Quick gearbox, can't believe this thing's stock. Crazy quick gearbox, it's amazing. Two hundred kilometers per hour. Ah, okay, five gears. I see a pattern with the RS 1800 Mark II. <laughs> okay, so it's doing okay on the tarmac. It's got that mid engined jazz going on where you kind of lose control a bit if you steer too quickly where the back end wants to go ahead of the front of the vehicle <laughs> I don't like it I don't like that whip but the vehicle is very responsive it's actually got good tires it does feel a bit like a rear wheel drive machine not like an all wheel drive machine Quick. See the interior view? Race car, that's what it screams. Wow. It feels very good in the interior view, I must say. And it also sounds pretty good in the interior view. After you get used to the vehicle, it's pretty good. I love that gearbox. Oh, nearly missed that checkpoint. See, it has that whip thing that the RS 1800 also has, but this one has it just magnified. So it's not very comfortable to drive, it's challenging. Goes. It helps you turn suddenly, you know, very quickly. Which, which I guess is pretty good on very technical rally courses. Nice. Okay, so 242.3, that's very quick. Nice. Getting better. But it is challenging, it comes at a cost. <laughs> right, let's see how it stacks up in the cross country event. Hoping it'll be better. This is like Ford's Ferrari, you know? <laughs> Mid-engined like a Ferrari. <laughs> Some Ferraris, at least. And we're bunched in. Come on, accelerate. Let's go, fourth gear. Come on. Careful with the throttle there. Okay. It's tricky, very tricky. Tons of power though, I love it. 
was great, but it, it's so challenging to drive. It takes so much concentration, I can't really talk whilst I'm driving this thing. You see, like as soon as I speak, I lose control. Man, the Fords started out as like really good, easy driving vehicles. This one is really tough, really difficult to drive. quick but it's tricky 258.5 not a bad time okay so this thing is very tricky to drive but let's see how it stacks up in the juggernaut the drag race is it better in a straight line than like on twisty and you know well look at that it's got double suspension that's crazy i didn't know that wow okay great acceleration Yes, I think you can take the gold home for a quarter mile in this vehicle, it's good. Ah, but here the problems start, just like with the RS1800. Needs longer gear ratios. So 247 kilometers per hour. That's quick, but it can do better. I bet you I think this thing can get close to 300 with its stock engine. It just needs the ratios to be tuned. Revs up to nearly 9,500 RPM. It's madness. There you are. 107.6. I've seen faster for S1. Okay, so, will it drift? I don't know. With a handbrake, it does drift, indeed. A little stiff. It does drift. Hmm. Good handbrake drift. You know? I'm not sure if it will drift on its own. Let's see. No. See, I automatically have to use handbrake. Let's try it again. On its own. Ah, oh, there it goes. Difficult though. Not easy. It feels heavy. It feels heavy on the tarmac. On the dirt, it's a whole different story. It feels much lighter than what it feels like on the tarmac. Anyway, there you have it guys. This has been the 1985 Ford RS200. Hope you enjoyed it. Like the video if you liked it. Subscribe to the channel if you want to support it. That would be amazing. And comment your thoughts below on this vehicle. What do you like about it? What don't you like about it? This rings dirt 3. <laughs> Thank you for watching. See you in the next video. Peace.